Welcome to an overview of the Environmental Response Management application, or IRMA. IRMA is an online mapping tool that integrates both static and near real-time data in a centralized, easy-to-use format for environmental responders and decision makers. Each IRMA site focuses on a specific region. This video will feature several different regional sites. Each IRMA features general data and information that is standard across all the regions, as well as data that is of particular interest to a specific region. For example, on the Arctic IRMA site, you can view shipping routes which are available on all the IRMA sites, but you can also view data on polar bear critical habitat and sea ice that are unique to the Arctic IRMA site. On every IRMA window, you will see your map controls and toolbar on the left and tool tabs on the right. The map controls and toolbar allow you to navigate around the map. Tool tabs allow you to explore, view, and analyze data in IRMA. In the Tools tabs, use the Layers tab to explore what data are available and to select specific data that you want to display. Click on the plus sign to expand the folder and the minus sign to close the folder. To see a specific data layer on the map, click on the box next to the layer's name. IRMA brings together a variety of data layers and data feeds from different NOAA offices and NOAA partners. New and updated data layers are routinely added to IRMA. Data that has been newly added to a regional IRMA site is listed in that site's recent data tab. With the IRMA map controls and toolbar, you can drag and reposition the map using the pan tool. Zoom in or out using the magnifier tool or slider. Use the previous and next extent icons instead of your browser's back and forward buttons to switch back and forth between views without changing any of your current layers. Measure distances using the ruler and areas using the polygon. To get more information, select the Identify tool and click on a point of interest on the map. You can also right-click on a map layer's name to view the metadata. Located at the bottom of the Layers tab are Bookmark Views. Click on the triangle icon to expand Bookmark Views. Bookmarks are collections of data layers that reflect information of special interest. By clicking a bookmark, the specific collection of layers will be displayed in IRMA. If you're having trouble finding a specific map layer, folder, or bookmark, the Find box at the top of the screen allows you to search by keywords and phrases. When you select a map layer from the search results list, it's automatically added to the map. Now that you've selected your map layers, use the Legend tab to identify various data displayed on the map, represented by different colors and symbols. Use the Query Tools tab to learn more about one or more subsets of data and information on the map. First, click the button to create a polygon and use your mouse to draw your selected area directly onto the map. Click once to draw the edges, and double-click to stop drawing. You can create more than one polygon to query. Next, you can use three different query types to analyze the data in your selected area. Layer Query by Polygon enables you to query a specific polygon on the map for all available IRMA-hosted data. ESI Query gives you information about coastal resources at risk. And the IPAC tool gives you information about U.S. Fish and Wildlife Trust resources. The Zoom tab provides two ways to zoom to a specific location on the map. First, using the location's longitude and latitude in decimal degrees, and second, using the location's name. Not all IRMA spatial data are available for download. In all cases, data should be downloaded from the data providers if at all possible. Links to the original data should be available in the full metadata record, available back on the Layers tab. You can print a PDF copy of the map displayed in the IRMA window. Before printing, you may need to adjust the zoom level and reposition the map since the legend will appear on the right side of the map. This information and more can be found on the Help tab and in the IRMA User's Guide. Explore all of the IRMA regional sites using the link below.